Just hours after releasing this photo, 51-year-old Alan Whitrook has been found. Police say he was wanted in connection with the gruesome murder of two people inside a home in Jamestown. Police made that discovery at a home here on Barrow Street earlier today. 7 Eyewitness News reporter Sierra Johnson live on the scene tonight with the very latest. Sierra. That's right. The suspect in this case has been arrested in Olean. He was wanted in connection for a double homicide that took place here on Barrows. That's right behind me. Investigators seem to be wrapping up a crime scene. They've actually been here since a little after 8 a.m. That's when they received a call of suspicious activity at the home. After entering, they found two dead bodies. Just a short time after, just a short time after that, they were able to locate the man in Olean. Now, right. Now, no new information on the victims is being released, but officers did address the media on an update on whether the suspect will face charges. Um, that will be actually up to collaboration between our office and the police department. That will be after we have a full analysis, a full review of all the facts, including uh, any, anything that's gained from any interviews today of the, of the suspect that the chief referred to. That's right. The suspect has been captured in Olean. Again, no information on the name, gender, or ages of those victims or the suspect's relation to the victims. And I'm actually joined here by my colleague, Jill Perkins, who will be following the story for the rest of the evening. Yeah, thanks, Sierra. For 11 o'clock, we hope to learn more about how and why the suspect was able to get to Olean and where exactly he was picked up. I'm also going to be working to find more, what, more about what police are saying could be a possible motive in this case. That'll be for tonight at 11, but at 7.30, we want you to tune in to your WKBW app on your smartphone or tablet. That's where we'll have the latest from the still very active, as you mentioned, Sierra crime scene here in Jamestown. For now, reporting live in Jamestown, I'm Jill Perkins for Sierra Johnson. Back to you in the studio, Jeff. Thank you very much. Also developing tonight, 